All right, guys, this is Grim Moon Gaming, and we are back today with another episode of God Eater Re Rage Burst. I about said Resurrection. I keep doing that. You always do. It's because I like Rage Bur or Resurrection. You know, it's just a really, really good game. And we're sorry about that, guys. I know you probably just heard that. That was actually... What a strong start. Yeah, that was... Horrible, horrible start. That actually, that actually made me think to mute my computer too. Yeah, Thanks. that that's good. Okay, at least it reminds you to mute your computer. Okay, we're gonna go with Julius, uh, Nana, and you know what? We'll go with uh, Shio. There you go. Uh, let's see here. Select yes. Start the mission. Do you know what the mission is? No, but I can find out what the mission is. All right. Um, all right, we're good on that. See, all you gotta do to see what the mission is is just go right here and it tells you gotta go fight Vajra good luck yep so anyway so we're gonna be fighting a Vajra here guys uh, should be fun I'm going to see if I can't craft a better weapon so I don't die I really really don't want to die let's see here I can make the Ice cleaver or the. You already got one of these. Type unknown. Okay, so I do not have one of these. Yeah, I'll make one. What the heck? You never know. Could come in handy. Alright, let's see here. How about. Do I want to craft a shield? No, I don't want to craft a shield. How about a control unit? Let's see if I can't find a better control. I already got one. Alright, I already got a good control unit. How about upgrade parts? Let's see, I have one of those already. Ooh, mainly booster two. Ooh, you know what? I'll go with it. I'll go with mainly booster two. That actually sounds like it'd be a good thing to have. Uh, we'll go to my loadout. Yeah, I already had mainly booster, see? Yeah, that's... I actually chose good then, guys, on that. Okay, so we got this scythe and that so we're pretty much set on that uh, now there is quite a few differences between this game and a bunch of games in its genre just to let you guys know uh, Monster Hunter was in the genre Monster Hunter was actually created first it was actually created on March 11th 2004 it was for the Wii and the PS2 uh, so there's that. Oh, I jumped. I hit the wrong button. Why am I jumping? There we go. Alright, so those games were made then. Uh, just to let you know that uh, there was another game out, and that right there was actually Final Fantasy Explorers. Final Fantasy Explorers was made in, uh, it says, December 18th, uh, 2014. Uh, that game, I actually like it a lot. Uh, I also like uh, the Monster Hunter series as well. Uh, I like the original to this game quite a bit. Uh, the only problem with this this genre of series of game, which is the God Eater series, is it takes forever to play the game. And if you're one of those people that like to play a game for quite a long time, then this is the game for you guys. It's got great story and everything. Uh, the only problem with it, like I said, was that it takes forever to beat. Uh, if you do like every single mission. So that's, that's the downside to it. All right, so I got that. Lock onto this guy. Oh no. I chose the wrong weapon. I chose the wrong weapon, guys. I am doomed. In other words, I'm gonna have to hit this guy just to hit him, and then hopefully... Hopefully I can do that. Ah, oh, man, I missed? Really? Alright, so 
but we're gonna keep going here. Oh. Hopefully he doesn't kill us. Let's see, huh? Anyways, what we were gonna talk about today, guys, is a bunch of stuff. Uh, I tell you when we get closer to a, a safe spot after I kill this idiot. He reminds me of Mr. Kipples. Hey, if you guys do not know who Mr. Kipples is, I am sorry. Uh, it, it was It's a long story. It's probably better for another day to be talking about Mr. Kipples. Uh, so we'll, we'll talk about Mr. Kipples another day. Oh my gosh, he about hit me. Oh, he did hit me. How'd he hit me? Oh. I do not know how he hit me. That don't make sense. No, we didn't lag. It's just he got me somehow. I don't like how that one. He's immune to lightning. It's because he's a lightning wielder. I'm using the wrong scythe against this guy, unfortunately. Oh, you have a lightning scythe? Yeah. That's what my scythe does. See, watch when it hits him. It's doing that 2% thing in the, oh, yeah. in the blue. That means that he's immune to that element. <laughs> so I chose the wrong weapon, unfortunately. I, I screwed myself on that. Have them in a way, yeah. But I can also shoot, hurt him with my gun. Because my gun is just normal bullets. Which I, I don't really understand that, really. He's alert. He's immune to lightning. Right? But when you shoot him with the bullets that you devour from him, you still hurt him. How, how does that make sense? You know? It, it just doesn't make sense to me. Let's see. Let's flash this guy. See how he likes a bomb. There we go. Uh, attack him. I don't think so, pussy cat. Oh, excuse me, guys. That cough came out of nowhere. I apologize. Oh, he's about dead. I can see it. You see his flashing on the screen in the radar. Maybe he's about to die. He's dead. Yay! Great job, guys. Oh, my gosh. That guy was actually not too bad. But at the same time, he was kind of hard. It could have been worse. Yeah, it could have been. I, I could have been using a weapon that, you know, gives him health. <laughs> that would have really sucked. No. Alright, we're gonna go with the team AP up. You seem to really like that AP up. Yeah. Well, the AP up actually gives them better stats, like I said, when you do personality. So, in other words, it allows you to boost yourself as well as your allies that you have in your party. I'll, I'll actually show here in a sec what that is. Tell you the truth, though, I love this game. I really, I do. It's just the first game to this series was way better. Uh, it was just so much more fun to play it. Uh, it's, I, I don't know how to explain it. I guess it was... Oh, Triple S. Cool. I, I guess you could say that it was less... Uh, stressful and less things clogging up the works of the game. So. Mm Won't let up. It's been this way ever since we entered the Far East. 
At least we should arrive at the branch soon. That's the stuff that came down before, right? While we were rescuing Shield. <laughs> I mean, is the red rain really as bad as all that? Mm -hmm. It gives people a disease called, um, it's called, what's it called? The Black Plague. It shares its name with an ancient epidemic, earned by the black scars that form. Any contact with the red rain could cause it. It's a truly terrible disease. There is no known treatment. Even the symptoms cannot be suppressed. Anyone who contracts it is condemned to die. Uh, so I just have to stay dry, right? Getting sick is the worst. You lose all your appetite. Fire has cleared the red rain and is continuing south through Far East territory. Repeat, Friar has cleared the Red Rain and is continuing south through Far East territory. We're almost there. Rachel, I hope you'll tell me the truth now. Why did you insist on moving the tests all the way out here? It is as I told Director Grimm. I wish to see our God Ark soldiers and my blood unit fight together. Hmm. Very well, Rachel. Listen. You know that the God Ark soldiers will open a whole new era for humanity. They can save us from those monsters. Of course I do, sweet sister. Worry not. I merely aim to ensure that they will serve us very well. Ah, look! The Far East branch is in view. We've almost arrived. Julius Tristanti, captain of the Blood Special Forces, and this is my team. Welcome to the Far East Branch. I am the director here, Taylor Sakaki. When I heard that Emil rescued you from certain doom, I just had to meet you face to face. Our vice captain was the one who fought it off. Ah, so it was you after all. I thought as much. You have my thanks. You're obviously a talented group, and I don't want to waste even a moment of that talent. Let's get you on a mission. The Far East Branch is currently facing several major threats. The most obvious, of course, is the Black Plague, caused by exposure to the Red Rain. Another pressing issue is... The Scion. Precisely. A species of origami unlike any we've faced before. Rumor is you've already fought one. The Scions use powerful resonance waves, biospheres, to control nearby herds of origami. I'm told Scions also interfere with our God Arcs, as they too are infused with Oracle cells. Still, against all odds, your unit disrupted its Scionic wave and sent it running. Truly a thing of wonder. I cannot tell you how reassuring it is to hear the beast can be beaten. So, I beseech your help mitigating these issues. The Red Rain pandemic and the Scions. What say you? We're glad to help. And we'll do our utmost to see these problems put to rest. support you in any way we can. Please make yourself at home here in the branch. That is all for now. Thank you. This Director, I asked everyone about their schedule so we could get a proper welcoming party going and Is 
this the blood unit? Thank you, Coco. And yes, this is blood. Great to meet you. I'm Kota Fujiki, captain of the Far East Branch's first unit. Julius Bastanti. Awesome. I'm still organizing the welcome badge, so feel free to take a look around till we're good to go. Work that out, Nana. It's food. You'll have to wait and see. Trust me, the food's amazing here at the Far East. Yes! This is gonna rock. All right, guys. That was pretty much the uh, cutscene that we just went through. Uh, so we're going to continue with this. Uh, we'd like to ask uh, any suggestions for future projects that you guys might like to see us do. Give us some uh, projects or something, you know, games that you guys would like to see us do. We'll definitely try to, you know, get those out there and uh, try some different games. See how we like them and stuff. Uh, oh, that looks fancy. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to continue and we're going to do our next quest here. Uh, let's see what I'm Harari, the operator of Far East Branch. I look forward to working with you. Uh, Ancients, Clarence. Sorry about the delay. Ah, uh, really? What's that mission active at the top left? It's not a mission. She won't even let me activate it. Uh, I gotta talk to this idiot again. Talk to Chugga Conroy. Oh my god, this guy pisses me off. I, I know it's a cutscene, but he, I swear this guy kills my brain cells how do you find the far east fire is the fire to be sure but this place has its own charm the smell of earth and oil isn't unpleasant Wait until you have to listen to it hard the people work I'm going to. sounds like Chuck the Conroy on crack what I did my evening tea I did it sent by me no Dude, it's it's like it's like dealing with glass, chalkboard scratching, cats meowing, cats pissing on themselves. It's that bad. I protect them, and in turn, they protect me. Oh my god, this truly is truly wonderful. Don't you think that's enough, Emil? Don't you think that's enough? Yeah. No. <laughs> Shouldn't we build a camaraderie with our honored guests? I was in the middle of a sentence. No. <laughs> oh, yes. This little I like her. Is Irina. Irina. She is the little sister er, of my sworn sword Arina. collector, Vogelweid. Oh, it's so good. In the first one, remember when he died? Oh. That's his sister. Okay. You know the little girl that had the hoodie hat on yes. all the time in the first yes. one I show you with? Yes. And that's her. She grew up and grew some boobs. <laughs> I can't tell there's a black box in there. Yeah. I rather like that. I am not you are really the little sister. sister. God there you guys are. Emil, Irina, we've got a mission. Oh, they're at it again, aren't they? Looks like Pitt. That's, uh, you know who it is. Coda, yeah. Sorry about this is Arena and Emil looks like the first Pitt unit. So I bet you already met Emil. Didn't we already see uh, Emil before in hmm? this game? Okay, that's pretty so. talented, I promise. Yeah, yeah he ran from the uh, proton thing that yeah, we right. got our power from. Yeah. He's like, oh my god, our not working. Isn't that the same guy that he you tried to activate his blood right food. after that and yeah. ended up almost getting swallowed? Your something like that? No, he, that's the idiot that tried to fight the crocodile thing by himself. Yeah, him. That's him, right? Yeah. Hey, okay. I'm nothing like that jerk. Okay. Well, okay. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, it'd be great if you took him out on a mission sometime. Yeah, Coda's a little tough. Not much, but a little. He got better. Of course. Esteemed rivals, let our competition... 
competition leads both of us to new heights of skill and chivalry. My brain cells are dying. Oh my god, I think my brain cells just died from listening to that guy talk, guys. I apologize. He, he kills my brain cells. Let's see if I can get it. Give me a mission! Oh, I hate you, Habari. Yeah, let's go here. Maybe if I go in here and talk to this idiot director, maybe he'll let me. Oh my god, I just want to do a freaking mission and get on with the mission. Seriously. Oh my god. Oh man, the girls at the Far East Branch are so hot. This is going to be awesome. Although, I guess the place does seem a bit run down. Man, I know this is the front lines, but I wasn't expecting this. Maybe I'll just spend my nights on Friar. Friar's way too hoity-toity. This is more normal. Are you guys serious right now? Normal? Not a chance. If this is normal, what about all the people outside these walls? Huh? All the people we ignore? Just barely scratching out a life? Uh, who are you? Satsuki Takamine, freelance journalist at your service. Hmm. You all look like you've come straight from headquarters, don't you? Yeah, sorry to break it to you, sister, but historically, I don't do well with journalists. Romeo, this one's all yours. Hey, wait, where are you going? My apologies for his behavior? Wow, you're really polite. What? Oh, hi. I thought you went on ahead, Satsuki. Oh, pardon me. Didn't I see you all when I visited Friar? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Hi, I can't believe it's you. Really, truly, actually, you. I'm Romeo. You are Yuno Akihara. I'm not worthy. Whoa, hey, slow it down. If you want to shake her hand, you gotta go through her manager. Me. You know, do you know these people? Not really. I saw them briefly on Friar. I just noticed they were about my age. It's a pleasure to meet you. I am Yuno Ashihara. <laughs> I know! Your songs are so awesome. You're so cool! I can't believe it's you. I'm not worthy! All right, Tiger. That's quite enough of that. <laughs> It's been a long time since I've had people my own age to talk with. I guess lately it has been one stuffy bureaucrat after another begging for autographs. Well, hey, I shouldn't keep Captain Koda waiting forever. So, how about I come back and get you later, you know? <laughs> Look, you seem like the same one of the group. It would be great if you could, you know, hang out with her. She really needs some friends. And keep an eye on that Romeo boy for me. I don't usually let the crazy ones get this close. There, try not to ignore the wolf. Devoured. <laughs> yes. Alrighty, guys. And that right there was the cutscene. And we are going to actually end our video today right here. Just to let you know, we are doing Dragon Quest Builders as a new uh, Let's Play. Uh, we will be moving this God Eater Rageverse to our special Saturdays thing. Uh, the reason why we are moving it to special Saturdays, just to let you guys know, uh, it's because really it's just I'm getting to the point where it's, it's boring and I don't have enough people to play the game with. And I, I, I really like to try to start some other Let's Plays as well. Try to get you guys more entertained as well. Uh, also, we had people during a live stream of Borderlands uh, that they said they wanted to see us do other Let's Play games. And they didn't really care about this game too much. 
So we will be finishing this. It'll just probably be moved to the special Saturday thing. And uh, it'll just be a little bit slower. So hopefully there will be future episodes. I'm pretty sure we're going to do future episodes, of right? Course. Yep. All right. So we'll do that. And we appreciate you guys watching with us. Uh, please like, subscribe, and donate if you want. And have a great day. See you guys.